Ahoy, all of you flick freaks out there. What is going on? My name is Andrew, and we are here with another Comic-Con trailer. They just dropped another bomb on us. We have the new Batman v Superman Dawn of Justice trailer. Uh, I'm super stoked for this movie. Can't wait to watch this, so I'm not going to say any more other than let's get right into it, shall we? <laughs> Today is a day for truth. The world needs to know what happened and to know what he stands for. That kind of power is very dangerous. Bruce Wayne was in Metropolis that day. Holy fuck! Let the record show that this committee holds him responsible. Oh my god. That's how it starts. The fever. The rage that turns good man. Cruel. This bat vigilante is like a one-man reign of terror. You don't get to decide what the right thing is. Nobody cares about Clark Kent taking on the Batman. This means something. It's all some people have. It's all that gives them hope. People hate what they don't understand. Be their hero, Clark. Be their angel. Be their monument. Be anything they need you to be. Or be none of it. You don't owe this world a thing. You never did. You know the oldest lie in America, Senator. The devils don't come from hell beneath us. They come from the sky. Twenty years in Gotham, how many good guys are left? Oh, oh my God! He has the power to wipe out the entire human race. That's the original Comic-Con clip. And we have to destroy it. Oh, whoa. Wonder Woman! In blue. <laughs> what? God versus man. Day versus night. Ah! The red capes are coming. The red capes are coming. <laughs> Holy fuck. And that right there, ladies and gentlemen, is how you do trailers. Uh, it's hard to describe how pumped I am for this movie. It, it's maybe bes behind uh, Star Wars, my most anticipated movie coming out. And then right after this, I have Suicide Squad. So two DC movies are like my... What some of my most excited movies that are coming out. Uh, finally getting to see action in this, not just talking and stuff. Oh, it's, it looks good. The combat looks good. The The style of the shoot. Uh, people were complaining about Man of Steel, about how it was dark and ominous, and only Batman is supposed to be brooding and stuff. I think, possibly, I, I'm not for sure, but maybe they knew that this was leading into... And it would throw people off if in Man of Steel it was, it, it wouldn't feel like it just 
flow directly into this new era of DC Universe that they're trying to create. But uh, I am pumped for this movie. It looks so good. Oh, it looks good. Jesse Eisenberg, Gal Gadot. Oh, Wonder Woman looks amazing. And I'll, I know you see uh, Lex Luthor with hair, but he actually is going to be bald in the movie, for those of you who uh, are wondering about that. Yeah, he is going to be bald. And I loved the little Easter egg of the Joker painting on Bruce Wayne's Batman costume. I love that. I'm not excited about seeing Bruce Wayne's history again. If it's less than a minute of the movie, then I'm okay with like just quick flashbacks, get it out of the way. Like, Cause everybody and their mother knows how Bruce Wayne became Batman. We don't need to see that story again. We didn't even really need to see the origin story of Superman. Everybody knows the whole, uh, Kal-El, Jor-El, everybody and all that stuff. Everybody knows that. So we don't need to see that anymore. Um, but there's a lot of superheroes out there whose origin stories people aren't really that familiar with. Wonder Woman, for example. A lot of people know who Wonder Woman are, but they don't know where she comes from. So she needs her just a quick intro into the Amazonian world so everybody knows that. I'm ranting now. I'm going to I'm gonna stop the video. I, so much stuff is going through my mind. Last thing I want to mention about the trailer, though. I'm interested to see what context there is for Batman in that sort of road warrior outfit where he's like cl climbing out of the, he's in the desert and it looks like Nazis. Is, I don't know what it is, but it would look really weird. And I'd love to see the context of that. But uh, until we figure all that out, I will catch you guys in the next video. I love you, Comic-Con. Thank you so much. And I'll see you guys at RTX or in the next video. And until then, Godspeed.